Hello everyone, and welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero. I'm Ryan Yakuma. Doc is here to watch me suffer as usual. And in between episodes I did a, a few improvements to the base, including this battery charger. Uh, thing is, um, while I was checking for uh, silver for the battery charger, I might have found a, a couple blueprints to scan. So now we have a... Uh, what are they? The grab trap unlocked, which I'm not sure if I should even bother crafting, probably not. I don't know. He never bothered with the grab trap when I played. More importantly, we have access to the mobile vehicle bay. That ain't gonna be. And while I was waiting for all of the batteries to recharge, um, I got a bit of a message from Alan. He basically just told me, yeah, there's some ruins there, go check it out. And he gave me a Oh, I, I guess it's I right have here. determined the location of some important technology. I implore you to investigate. Will this help us build you a body? I do not know what we will find. I just know it is important. And that's it. Oh yeah, I also harvested some lantern trees and put them right back in the planter. Because why wouldn't I? We also have some more space here, yay! Um, I'm gonna start some things for now. We do need titanium ingot, lubricant, and computer chips. I was that again. Let's see, computer chip is okay. That should be easy. So titanium ingot is just titanium, no shit. And lubricant the zip clusters. Okay, that should be easy to get. And we just need like one more copper for that, so. Cool. You just gotta prep the lube. Basically. Oh yeah, the place I found the last blueprint for the. Uh, for the mobile vehicle thing was like. They're, they're kind of all over the place, so yeah. it doesn't really matter. It was like on the bottom of one of the creep vine clusters thingy. Like, I think it was down there or in a different one, I'm not sure. Oh, hey, copper. Fish. I know this. That's why I kept... Oh yeah, there it is. That's kind of why I kept swimming. Hey, that sea monkey nest has something you can scan in it. Yeah, that's... That's where the mobile vehicle... No, it has something you can scan in it. That means you haven't scanned it yet. Oh. Uh... I'm lost. There it is. Oh well, I did need more titanium. Right, let's uh, let's go back out. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Well, I am kind of curious about that. Do I get her there from this? Maybe. No. I still haven't found that. Should I go try to find it, or do you think I should try to get a uh, vehicle first? I would try to get the vehicle and the um, depth upgrade. Yeah, good point. Alright, let's go to the other side because there aren't any... Oh, never mind, there's some. Which means technically all one is some more titan. Can you grow the creep vines? Yes. Do you need the clusters or the, or the samples for that? 
What is the name of the cluster? Oh. Got it. So I should have grabbed another one. Oh, one. Well. Actually, didn't I have some here? I, I should probably check. I should also just... You know those aren't going to grow anything, right? Now I do. You need to cut them and get uh, growing samples from them with the knife. Uh... The ribbon plants, specifically. I also grabbed a few creature eggs. I'm not sure which ones they are, but it's those two. Anyway, the rest of the materials are back at the main base. And as you can see, I made some more solar panels, so you know, that's nice. Welcome aboard, Captain. Yes, yes, I know. of cover, damn it! Congratulations! Oh yeah, you also made a coffee maker, just because I could. I mean, coffee is useful. Silver. Not what I was looking for, but you know, I take it. Uh, there we go. Alright. That out of the way. Open. Make the computer chip. I guess I need this thing. Why not? Uh, not the mineral detector, which I probably could have used to find the copper. Whatever. The mobile vehicle bay is made in the fabricator. Well, it's so huge. <laughs> At least I think it is. Oh, well, <laughs> whatever. Deployables, deployables. Wait until you see how much inventory space it takes up. That's more on the lines of what I actually expected. Alright, alright. I can have the vehicle way, but that doesn't mean I know how to make any vehicles. 
Yay! I'm really surprised you haven't gotten all the uh, truck stuff. Yeah, I just didn't find the other stuff. Oh well. I'm gonna store some stuff. By the way, you're better off with the horseshoe shrub nuts. Well, I haven't found those yet, have I? I might have. Yes. Those. They were at the Delta Station dock. Uh... Have you made the rebreather yet? Nope. That's the next step. You should. Yep. Which means I need to find one more piece of silver. You also haven't found the high capacity O2 tank yet. Nope. The lantern fruit, I will admit, is better for getting for keeping the bioreactor powered. That's good to know. So what you're saying is I should probably head back to Delta Station. Yeah. But the horseshoe shrub nuts are better for actually eating. Om nom nom. Exactly. I should probably head back to the test stage. Anyway, I'm not happy. Elon Musk speedrunning Factorio in real life. What? Elon Musk is speedrunning Factorio in real life. That's... Unusual. By the way, Ran, I would... You should probably set that thing to look for Argentite if you're looking for silver. I should probably go deeper first. Well, it's just you're looking for specific biomes. Granted, those biomes happen to be deeper than you currently are. this place out of... Uh, what's the word? Argentite. I'm pretty sure there was another trip and cluster this one. There is apparently already a map mode for this game, but I'm gonna refrain from using it. At least for now. Did I go the wrong way? I probably went the wrong way. I come near you. Not exactly what I was looking for, but I'll take it. I realized there were two more that I just don't want to. Eh, actually, I have the space. Quartz, I have enough for now. Let's use my copper tongue. Anyway, there's some circle, I mean, uh, creeper vine, whatever. And sea monkeys. Yeah? Yeah. Ok. 
Okay, time to head back to base. That should be all I need to craft the rebreather. Yeah, I have. I have more seed clusters, I think. We're right here, might as well. Yeah, I finally had a good use for that beacon we have found like forever ago. Just put it right on the entrance. <laughs> All right. So, fabricate. Actually, I need to grab that silver I stole. Uh, silicon rubber. Rebreather facilitates extensive free diving by recycling air more efficiently at Oh cool it automatically equipped it's significant Store some of the depths Read the freedom From testing into weather Check Delta Station again. Hopefully without getting myself killed. Look, I am always going to be terrified about that. You shouldn't be. Especially since this area seems to be relatively safe, but you know. Never be too careful. Haven't even seen one of them up close yet. <laughs> Maybe they're nice and cuddly once I actually see them up close. Haha. <laughs> nice and murdery is kind of accurate. Yeah, that would be more close. More close. What is that thing's kind of one? No. Alright, so. I went up at the main base, right? The horseshoe nodes or whatever. They were in the caves. Oh. Oh. Those ones. Alright, I should probably stab these things. No? Do I just plant the nuts? I guess I do. Yes, you just plant the nuts. Nuts are seeds. Fair enough. Well, at least I quickly saw stuff. I should probably have gone and checked if there was a... Uh... Probably check if there's uh, seed rock things to scan up here. Uh, 
I probably scanned them already. You, we were pretty thorough in that area, at least, I think. Pretty sure we were. At least I don't have much of an aggro range. I can see, and I can see them from far away enough to keep my distance. You know, as long as it's daytime. I don't remember if I scanned the thing that, uh, that gives gold. I should probably have checked on that. Those are a lot more useful. Oh hey, at least once I finally get around to building the bioreactor, I can still use the lantern fruits for that. Lantern plants, whatever. That might not be the best place for the battery charger, but I'll manage. Actually, no. Probably a better, better spot. Alright. So I think it's time to go look at those ruins. Good luck! Yeah, I probably need it. Um, drink a little water. I'm gonna cook one of the fish. Change their tune. Thank you, sea monkeys. Sadly, it doesn't seem like there's anything really to scan here. Warning 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. shipment that those buggers have gotten their weird little hands into. Now we're running low on flares and 
I'm gonna have to search nearby nests for stolen cargo. They're lucky they're kinda cute. Raccoons of the sea, those ones. Raccoons of the sea, huh? Yeah. Not wrong. Alright, time to head down. That's for the uh... It's for I cast ye. Hey, sea monkey offered you something. Take the sea monkey's gift. Don't be rude. That's also probably useful. I'm also kind of worried about my lack of air. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. And, oh. Perfect. Still, I'm getting kind of lost. You'll be fine. Will I? more than just an artifact. It will help me follow the traces my people left on this planet. I'm glad it could help. I know you would still prefer me to have a corporeal form of my own. Well, yes. If you continue searching, I may regain some of my connection to the network, piece by piece. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. There's some air, air, air. Wow. Thanks, you monkey. Oh. Okay, use your bladder. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, I wish just, you know, making sure that there wasn't any... directly above you that would make me drown yeah but yeah sea monkeys are really nice now i almost never have them give me things i only know that they can because of the wiki <laughs> and they gave me like five things in one expedition <laughs> one of those things was, was even gold Maybe it depends on which area you are on. Yes, it does, because they just pick up stuff that's on the ground and give it to you. Yeah. I might have gone there and gotten my inventory full while I was looking for silver, so that might have been relevant. Like, maybe they just picked the things I had to leave behind. The sea monkeys have changed their tune. Not only have they stopped stealing, they brought me something I actually needed. I may have to revise my opinion of them. Oh well, I guess I can tune that one out for now and... Uh, I'm not sure if I actually got anything out of that other than just scanning it. Oh. 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 I just unlocked an ender chest. Yes, but remember, ion cubes come in limited quantities. Yeah. And I... That's a deployable, right? I'd much rather use them for batteries than for that, to be honest. Yeah. There is a defabricator, though, that I would probably use them for. Yeah. I mean, it was, could still be convenient because it's... Since it's a 
a deployable I can basically just carry it around as extra storage. But yeah, there's also it requires an advanced wiring kit, which actually that's not too bad. I would need to get some more coral samples, but it, yeah, it's not that expensive. Other than the ion cube, of course. And this is already getting full because, of course, it does. I should probably make some more wall lockers. In fact, I will. I mean, it's just titanium and some space on the walls. There. Finally, some use to all that titanium. For now, though, I hope you'll have fun, and we'll see you next time. We finally ended an episode at a semi-decent time, huh? Anyway, bye bye